Hello and welcome to another Help Me Place update video. This is version 2.0 and we'll just be going through all the new features. So now we can actually align things to the normals of what they're uh, being placed onto. So you'll see here this new, new feature, Align to Normal, with the Q hotkey is actually rotating the box here to the normal that it's that it's being placed on. So very handy for things like um, fences uh, or anything on a slope. We have set up a space scene with some new prefabs uh, all included with Help Me Place. We've loaded all the space prefabs, some variants in there. Um, and you'll see that they, when we place them, are aligning to the sphere or the uh, the planet here. So very nice, very useful feature. Will allow you to um, create your scenes very quickly. So we now can change axis of rotation. So this tree is now being rotated in the Z axis and also X axis or Y axis. Also, uh, the UI over here has gotten an overhaul. You'll see now that there's some prefab group utilities along with the groups themselves in the prefab groups tab. We also have a configuration tab and a system tab. Uh, inside the prefab groups tab as well, we have these utilities. So if you've loaded a lot of prefabs, um, we've gotten some feedback that that happens quite a bit. So especially with Cinti packs and stuff like that. So let's go ahead and use the create new prefab group from folder. Let's go in as, uh, as far as prefabs buildings. So we'll add all the buildings into one group. So you'll see here we have quite a few of them. And if we go down to that group in the UI, you'll see that it's just, it, it's a lot. So we can copy this in here, the group name and we can split it into groups of five. And you'll see now that it's created three of these groups, uh, two groups of five and one group of two. It also copies all of the properties that were set in the original group. Also, when you hit the plus button, um, it copies the previous one for handiness, but a lot of people don't want that. So you can hit the reset this group button on any expanded group and it will actually clear it out for you. So very handy kind of features being added this update. Um, yeah, I hope you enjoy them, especially this, uh, this new one. Very handy. So thank you very much and I'll see you in the next video.